thing I've found is that the stars mingle with the crowd, and some of them really are stars, not least the big boys, the top American pros. You can't have a BMX World Championships without the legendary Hollywood Mike Miranda. Mike, welcome back. Thanks, it's great to be back again. Great. Now, very briefly then, give us uh, a potted history of BMX biking from when it started right up to this 86 World Championship. Okay, well, BMX started in Southern California near my house. It started with a bunch of kids on old-time bikes just imitating motorcycles with jumps and just jumping sometimes over trash cans and other obstacles. Uh, it steadily progressed, got more organized, and then uh, about the end of the 70s, it was really a money-making business. And then with the movie E.T., that brought a big boom in our sport. You know, a lot of people saw BMX for the first time through that movie. Then. Uh, which is almost how it is now with the new movie, Rat. Here comes the cliffhanger. Like in baseball here, you're either safe or you're out. Jones is on. Taylor is safe. Be, be honest here, do you see BMX taking a possible dive in popularity much the same as a skateboarding did in the early 80s? In our country, what happened was it grew at a steady rate and then it leveled off. Now, when it leveled off, a lot of people thought, oh, it's going to go down. But just now in our country, it's starting to go back up again. So, and I think it's due to the movie. Well, this is Hollywood. Cause I'm a show off. Four to five, three, sixty.